Hello, you are watching Currency Market News on InstaForex TV channel with me, Kate Nidachina. Today, the US dollar is likely to be the only currency to gain ground. After the fairly strong Friday report on consumer sentiment, traders await the next set of positive information from the US statistical agencies. According to preliminary estimates, the University of Michigan recorded a sharp price in consumer sentiment. The indicator saw to an eight-year high, hitting the mark of 93.8 points. Today, positive data is expected on industrial production in the United States. Analysts anticipate the trend of steady growth to persist, predicting a monthly increase of 0.7%. An additional reason for the greenback purchases has become a hostage taken in Sydney Cafe. The local authorities have already recognized this event a terrorist attack. According to Australian Prime Minister Tony Abbott, the action is likely to have political motives. There is the US Consulate General located in front of the cafe where the hostages are held. According to US Department of State spokesperson Jen Psaki, the staff has been evacuated. Apart from this, market participants are likely to adjust positions ahead of the Fed meeting this week and Christmas holidays next week. This year, last meeting will be held on Wednesday. Основная валютная пара евро-доллар консолидируется в довольно узком диапазоне между The main currency pairs consolidating in a fairly narrow range between 1.2425 and 1.2485. In our view, the Fed meeting could trigger a strong US dollar rally ahead of the new year. First of all, it can be caused by expectations of the Fed to give a clear signal regarding its intentions to normalize monetary policy. In in other words, uh, the decision to raise interest rates next year. The consolidation is likely to continue with some strengthening of the US dollar today, and the major movements will likely to take place on Wednesday. The euro greenback pair is likely to try breaking through the border of the narrow corridor I mentioned above and to test the level of 1.24. If so, the consolidation pattern will be broken and the pair will try to consolidate below. Сегодня пара евро-доллар попробует все-таки пробить нижнюю границу этого узкого коридора, о котором я говорил выше, и протестировать уровень 1.24. Если это произойдет, то тогда, э, фигура, э, то тогда консолидационная фигура нарушится и вполне вероятно уже сегодня пара попробует закрепиться ниже уровня 1.24.00. This scenario is quite expected due to new political shocks across the European currency bloc. Investors are selling off the euro on the back of the early parliamentary vote for the president of Greece. The heart of the state should be determined as early as this week, which is two months before the planned date. Market players express high concerns of results of the hasty vote. If the Syriza party comes to power, chances of Greece to exit the Eurozone increase greatly. It was Insta Forex News and me, Kate Nidachina. Have a nice trading day.